This tutorial is going to show you how to embed a series of videos into a page. The tutorial assumes that you know how to embed a video. If you don't, then watch the appropriate tutorial first. Now, if you have multiple videos on one theme, then you'll want to create a separate page for them and then to link that page of videos to the appropriate unit page. In the last video, you would have seen me embed this video into the Term 1 unit page. Let's say I've now found a whole lot of other videos and I want them all on a separate page. Let me show you an easy way of doing that. First of all, I'm going back to the home page, turn editing on, and I'll open the term one unit page in edit view in a new tab. Because I want access to this tab, I'm going to create a new page here and I'll drag it down underneath the term one page. So click and Add an activity, page is down the bottom nearly, and add. There's my title, I'll copy that into the description, and then this is the page down here that I'm going to create. So here's my new page, which is blank, and in the next tab, full screen, I've got the original term one page. So I'm just going to put my cursor down next to that video, delete it, down here though, so I'm just adding some text and I'm going to hyperlink the new page to the word here. Page. I can now save that and return to the course there, but over here I need to insert or embed my videos. Now, here's a little trick. One of the challenges of embedding videos is because of all the code that's on a page, it's difficult to insert videos in amongst the code. So the e it's much easier to embed a video at the bottom of the code. So I'm, I've just copied the embed code. I need to click HTML, and I'm just going to, at the end of that code, drop in the embed code. So that's the first video. Now what I'm going to do is copy the second title. I'm just going to post that at the end there and grab the next bit of embed code. But before I do that, I'm just going to show you a little trick. I've already mentioned in the previous video that in order to center a video, we need to add the word center, American version, in these triangular brackets at the start of the code and at the end it's the same with a forward slash for the word center and you can see that I, I have got one more bit of code to get so let's go to that video here it is so I want the URL first because sometime in the future I'm bound to want to open this up and if I've got it all on one document, that's going to be really handy. Click Embed. I'm assuming you know how to do this because you've already seen it in a previous tutorial. Control-C. And I'm going to slot that in between. And there we go. So now we've got all the embed code. So where were we up to? We had just put in the title. So now I'm going to grab the embed code there for Jupiter the largest and drop that at the end. So you'll be seeing this sped up and even though I don't do this as fast as you see it on the screen, it is quite a fast job and not very difficult. Then we click update and have a look at what we've got. Did that work? Pretty cool. And the other thing we can do um, I'm going to go control A, highlights everything, so I can bring my font up to about size 18. Uh, if I go control A again, and go center, there we go. So all the titles are centered. Look, if you, if you get frustrated with Moodle, the Moodle editor, you're not alone, because it is pretty frustrating. Anyway, we get by in the end. There we go.
So then we get out a full screen. And save and return to the course. Okay, so next thing we need to do is to drag this down. I'm going to put it under term one because it is linked to term one and I'll indent one step so I know that the planet videos was part of the term one page. And the final thing I need to do is to link this page into this page. So I need the URL, therefore I need to open the planet videos in read view. I'm going to do that in a new tab. But the term one page I'm going to edit. There's the video page, grab the URL, copy, uh, control C, and here is the, um, here's the text I added. So highlight the word here, insert edit link, and I'm going to open this in, a, in the same window because this is a Moodle element. Exit full screen, save return to the course. So now in an ideal world, when we click this icon, it opens to our Term 1 page, and this hyperlink will go to our video page. And that's how easy that can be. Thanks for watching.